Martha. You, you know what? No, just, just watch what has happened in this case so far. Um, Alvin Bragg dumped this case. Mm -hmm. He didn't oh, pursue yes. this case, okay? Now maybe we're figuring out why. Maybe Alvin Bragg understood that the statute of limitations wasn't going to hold up in this case, but no, the woman who is in front of the video, do you want me to get him? Do you want me to get him? I'll go get Donald Trump. She went, you know, guns a-blazing, forward with this case, and now she has been embarrassed by this judge who would love to get this guy, right? But he looks at the case and says, oh, my gosh. Why did you bring this to me? You've got about 80% of this that doesn't even hold up in the statute of limitations. On top of that, so they are so overexposed, right, between Bragg and how he handled it, and then Letitia James, and now this judge, they all exactly. look, it's embarrassing for all of them at it this is. point, right? The other side of this is, show me the bank that has been wronged, deceived, there's, there isn't one. There's no injured party in this case. So did they bring these kind of similar cases against other real estate developers in this? I'm not saying it's right to overvalue your, your property, but the bottom is the, the rubber hits the road when the valuators from the insurance company and the bank right. look at it. If you say this property is worth $80 million, they go, ah, sorry, it's not. They have teams of valuation people at banks and insurance companies. Nobody is un not understanding how much these properties are worth. This, there's a lot of cases that are up. He has 91 counts, criminal counts, okay? This one is, is blowing up in their face, and I think it's going to be an embarrassment. And there was a massive disclaimer also on their assessment saying, you decide what it's worth. That's yeah. right. Yep. All right. Hi, everyone. I'm Brian Kilmeade. I want you to do me a favor. I want you to click to subscribe to the Fox News YouTube page. This is the only way that I know for sure that you're not going to miss any great commentary, any great news bites, any great interviews coming your way on Fox. You can get it all here on YouTube. So subscribe right now.